Alright, so today I'm going to touch on the drinking rules of Mom's Bluff. Uh, to help me demonstrate, I have vodka and cranberry juice. Of course, you can interchange those with different alcoholic drinks and also just play Mom's Bluff while drinking casually. However, if you want to play by the official rules, you can get a shot of liquor and pour that into the glass with whatever chaser you like or mixer. So this could be rum and coke and for this purposes I'm doing vodka and cranberry juice. So everybody who's playing the drinking version will have a shot in front of them and also a glass with a shot and a mixer in it. Alright so when you lose typically you lose the three cards and so if I played and I lost, I would lose three cards. That would also require the player who lost to have three sips of the mixed drink. Now, if two people had a war, and they both put the three cards down and then flip it, and if I lost, the person who lose actually the way to do a war is you put three cards down, both players would then have to take a shot, and then they'd flip a card to see who won. And the loser would have to take another shot. Last but not least, if anybody plays and wins with the mom's bluff card, every other player at the table would have to finish their mixed drink and take a shot. Now those are the rules of playing with mom's bluff while drinking. So to recap, if you just lose a regular hand you have to take three shots of the mixture and whenever you get into a war you have to put one, two, three cards down, take a shot, and then shoot and reveal who wins. The loser of the war would then have to take another shot. Now, when somebody wins with the mom's bluff card, everybody at the table has to take a shot and finish their mixed drink. So that recaps the drinking rules for mom's bluff. Have fun.